Hello! I don't know where that came from. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all well. Welcome if you've been here before. Welcome back even and welcome if you're new. It's so nice to have all of you here. I'm grateful for every single one of you. Today I decided to do a what I eat in a day and it's a realistic what I eat in a day. It's no like is it acai bowls and fruit and nuts and granola and you know what's it called couscous and hummus and all that stuff which I do like actually but a naughty version but today is realistic it's literally what I could get my hands on what grub I fancied in the moment it's someone who is navigating their way slowly to health ish so trying to eat healthy ish vegetarian food but trying to be realistic as well and you know it's not the best day I don't think coming up I have a few cravings but I'm going to try not to I'm really craving cheese and chocolate oh my gosh and nuts always the naughty nuts anyway the naughty naughty nuts where's that come from family friendly the naughty nuts like pistachios cashews peanuts you know that the fatty nuts the ones full of protein and good stuff but fat anyway <laughs> I do hope you enjoy see you in a minute good morning time for brekkie I can't lie and say it's really early looking at my state it looks like it's about 6 30 it's not it's about 9 30 a.m and I'm just not a morning person so I'm also not a breakfast person so I'm gonna be really honest and show you what I'm about to have I'd love to say it's granola fruit yogurt and all these seeds and nuts on top but it's not because I can't be bothered so try not to laugh so here's my breakfast I'm joking. Actually, it is this kefir drink, cherry. Um, can't really lie and say I normally have breakfast, so this will have to do. <laughs> mm, that'll do. A few swigs of that, just keeping it real. Yeah, just a quick look at the Aldi lunchtime selection. I don't think there is a meal deal here, but this is the stuff they have. It's not much there. Let's see if my hair scraped back, lovely. Yeah, I think I'm going to pop to Sainsbury's instead, get the old goodie, the old meal deal. So here is the little Aldi meal deal, the cheese and caramelised onion toasty, 189 The gingerbread iced latte, 65p, and the banana was from a bunch which cost me 78p, so the meal deal in its entirety, including an extra bunch of bananas to enjoy later on in the week, was £3.32, which is not bad. Definitely cheaper than all the other supermarkets. So I think that'll do quite nicely. Mm, I don't think that's my most flattering angle. I was trying to be clever there with the camera work. That <laughs> didn't quite work, did it? Anyway... That gingerbread latte, oh yes, I can recommend. As someone who's neither a connoisseur of coffee or a coffee fan, actually, it was sweet, it was cool, refreshing. If you have a sore throat or you don't really want to eat much, oh yes, oh so good. Probably a bit too much sugar, I'm not even going to check the sugar content, but anyway, my verdict on my little meal deal that I made up at Aldi, 3.32 for a sarni banana and drink, yeah, absolutely fine. If I were to change anything, I would go for veg next time. I am for a little bit of corn for supper. Ignore the meat because that's not mine in the freezer, but we're going to have a vegetarian chicken and leek family pie with veg. I'll just show you the dogs quickly. That's my dog, Daisy. Hello, and this is Ted. Yeah, you ain't getting any, you two. <laughs> right, so I chuck it in. It looks really unappetizing at the moment, but I'm sure it'll taste absolutely fine. Don't have a clue what I'm doing, to be fair. But, um, set it on about that, that'll do. And then about, I don't know. Yeah, that'll do. Just gonna show you a little face poking through. Oh, look, hello. Are you hungry? Shall I feed you now? Go on then. Ooh, coming along nicely. So this is the final result. And as you can see, I am no chef, 
nor do I have any clue on presentation, but I'm sure it'll taste good, which is the main thing. Well, what can I say? I found these. Caramelised biscuit flavour cookies from Aldi. There happens to be two left in the packet, which happens to be a fairly good after supper snack. It is what it is. When they're gone, they're gone, right? Thank you so much for watching my little video, my what I eat in a day video. I've been as honest as I possibly could with the exception of two things. I did pop to the McDonald's drive through and I got a McCafe toffee nut latte. I can't lie. I didn't have much money on me. Had I had more money, I possibly would have splurged and got some chips or those cheesy bites. But I'm being honest, I probably would have, you know, been weak with junk food and all that, but I just got my latte. I also thought about a milkshake and the milkshake machine was broken. <laughs> you couldn't make it up, could you? It's always broken at Burger King or McDonald's, which is probably for the best. Anyway, so I enjoyed my toffee nut latte on the way home. It was very pleasant. I've also had a bit of water, which I haven't documented. And I also, if I haven't included it in the other clip, I had some orange juice with my iron pill to absorb it better into your system, all that kind of thing. Looking back at the footage, I can see that I don't have enough fibre or fruit and veg and as per probably a bit too much processed food but sometimes it's the easiest thing isn't it I can't lie and say I'm perfect none of us are I've tried my best to be as honest <laughs> and authentic as, as possible but I can see where I want to improve I want more greens more leafy greens more healthy nuts and fats and oils and all that jazz you know you know how it is but I don't drink alcohol really I don't smoke I don't do drugs other than junk food and a bit of processed junk it is what it is I can do better I know that even if I don't want to do it to lose weight and it's just for you know for being a bit more healthy and maybe being healthy in my system and whatever and just eat cheap, making better choices I think we can all eat a little bit healthier if we want to and I am in the right place now to do that and I know where I need to do that anyway um <laughs> me babbling on about nothing as per I know what I mean okay I know what I'm trying to say I'm not I'm trying to say that every little bit towards your goal is better than stepping away from your goal hmm that's quite good actually no, it's not. It's, I know what I mean, though. Anyway, if any of you have any comments or critiques on my diet or my videos, do let me know. Constructive criticism is always gratefully received here. As long as it's all in the right place and it helps me in some way, I'm open to any suggestions. Also, again, if you have any ideas, you want to see my videos or me to try different things, I'm up for quite a few things, I can tell you. So let me know. Have a lovely week. Thanks so much again for joining us. Take care of yourselves and of each other. And I will see you all soon, hopefully. Bye.